I haven't had any experience before. I know it's a big disadvantage. I can say yes, but at the same time no. In high school, not English, but in German. Yes, I had several experiences when I was in middle school, but I don't count them as a professional play. This is so I can say that this is my first play. Uh, no, but I always want it. I always want to be an actor, but I couldn't encourage it. Yes, I have had the experience in high school. No, this is my first time I have been doing such a things like this. Yeah, when I was 10, I played Jester on the Princess and the Pea, and it was quite interesting and quite fun actually. Yes, I have um, in, in other countries, not in Turkey. This is my first one in Turkey. Yes, I had. When I was in high school, we acted theater game, but it was a little bit shorter than Romeo and Juliet. No, I haven't actually, but in high school I was at a ceremony, but I joined it. Yes, when I was in the second year of my department, we performed parody of Life of Elizabeth I. Um, unfortunately not. I had actually, when I was six years old, uh, in kindergarten but I don't count it as a experience because I was a little and it was in a professional show so I didn't have basically no this is my first experience uh, last year I have little experience I have a small role in that stage because I have a stage phobia I am afraid an experience Unfortunately, no. When I was in high school, actually, I really wanted to join such a play, but I was very shy. No, this is my first time, actually. No, I haven't had any experiences before. Uh, yes, we have. Uh, we acted about Queen Elizabeth, but uh, it's a uh, like situational comedy. Uh, no, I didn't, uh, but always wanted to. Uh, then I saw this and I wanted to try. I'm here. Uh, yes, I did. I was in the high school. I only took one play. It was a good experience to me. He wrote the things that we still discuss and it's incredible. And if you study English language and literature, we see lots of Shakespeare, we read lots of Shakespeare and yeah, he is really genius. I know pretty well about Shakespeare and I really appreciate his works so I also like to read his works well I found Shakespeare's plays so very dramatical for me but I can't deny his importance in the world of literature to be honest I didn't uh, know anything about Shakespeare except Romeo and Juliet and Hamlet I think Shakespeare's works all about human weakness love, fear. That's why I love Shakespeare so much. I see Shakespeare very inspirational a man. He is expert on playing with the words. I love his works like Romeo Juliet, Hamlet, etc. I think his dialogues, his scenario, priceless. I can say that. Shakespeare is a great man. He's a great writer. And his imagination is just so good. I love it. Shakespeare is a creator of modern theatre. He is genius and playing his games are so good, I think. He is one of the most influential writers for English language and literature students. Shakespeare is really important person for English literature. Shakespeare is known as a great writer. Through plays and theatres and uh, his priceless sonnets, he added many new words and expressions to English language. Um, to be honest, I'm not a big fan of Shakespeare, um, but <laughs> his sonnets are awesome for me. I'm such a big fan of his um, sonnets. I adore them. His writing style is just magical. Shakespeare is a big writer and he wrote so many sonnets, plays and theaters. He wrote under harsh conditions, but today it is even understand uh, these works. As you know, this is my first year in our department. <laughs> To be honest, I don't know so much thing about Shakespeare, but I will know. I have to know. I actually didn't read about Shakespeare, so I don't know, but his works are really magnificent. As language and literature student, I have to work with his work. So, you know, I love him. I love his works too. Shakespeare was 
the father of the English literature in terms of his sonnets and plays, tragedies, comedies. Uh, I really love him and appreciate him. Uh, Shakespeare is a very successful writer. I like his writings. Well, uh, I'm an English language and literature student, so naturally I love him. He's a legendary writer. I think we became great team with players. You, you are learning to how to group work actually and it gives you an opportunity that you express yourself clearly and better. It really helped me to socialize with others. Uh, there is so many people that I didn't know in my department. I get to know people a lot better. Well, I've met lots of great people and I've met lots of talented teachers and I'm very happy about that. I am not professional in acting. So, I didn't know anything. But after rehearsals, I am so excited, so happy about being couplet. I am so proud. I developed myself in theater. I always interest in theater, but I never have an opportunity until now. My attitude was this. I was a bit shaming out doing this, but later on after the every rehearsal, I I think I'm improved myself slowly, slowly. I've met new friends and get in touch with other teachers in the department. It was quite interesting, quite fun and exhausting. I feel I'm growing further than I was and um, I feel I'm, I'm getting better and better in every rehearsal. First practice was very difficult for me, but now I am really comfortable because I memorized the sentences, dialogues, so it's now, it's everything is good, I am very happy. I can find new friends and also I am practicing myself. I am trying to say more fluently for my pronunciation and the words will be better uh, day by day. We made such a good friendship among us. It was so good and I don't have an experience. I uh, experienced the feeling of being on the stage. I got the confidence now. I have met new friends who played in theater and I tried to gain my uh, stage phobia. They taught me how to play in a theater. I had a chance to meet so many people, teachers, students. Yeah, that's so. Thank you. Well, I made a lot of friends, meet a lot of people, and the practices are very fun to do. So I'm grateful to be here. At first I was nervous, I was really nervous, but then I got used to being on stage. I got over being nervous on the stage. This makes me self-confident. I learned acting. Uh, rehearsals gave me experience about reading and theater, and I gained a lot of friends. Well, I had a chance to observe others, their uh, body language, and you know, I had an empathy with them by observing.